Maximum oral structures are having their origin from the options are ectoderm, mesoderm, endoderm and none of the above. So when we refer to the maximum oral structure that means the structures that are seen in the oral cavity. So I would like to discuss about the surface ectoderm derivatives here. So the surface ectoderm derivatives which are seen here are going to be the various options are there. So the first thing is going to be your epithelium and glands epithelium and glands and under the epithelium and glands will be having your skin epithelium sweat glands and sebaceous glands so there will be skin epithelium then there will be sweat and the sebaceous gland sebaceous glands the second thing which we have here is going to be your myoepitheliocytes myoepitheliocytes that is MECs of skin gland. The third thing that is going to get uh, the derivation from the surface ectoderm is going to be any external opening. So when I say any external opening of the oral cavity. So the first thing is of course we are oral opening. And the second thing can be your Rathke's pouch that is going to form most the opening of the most of your pituitary. Most of the pituitary's opening is going to be formed from the Rathke's pouch. The fourth thing which we have here that can be derived from the surface ectoderm is going to be your salivary glands. Salivary glands. And these salivary glands are going to be, of course, all the major glands here. So, what are the major glands? Of course, the parotid, the submandibular, and the, the third one is going to be your sublingual gland. The sublingual gland. Then we have uh, the various things which we have here. We can just see this in the figure here. So, the glands, parotid gland, the submandibular gland, the sublingual gland, the tongue. And there are various other things which are derived from the ectoderm. So most of the oral cavity is derived from the ectoderm except one that is the floor of the mouth. So floor of the mouth is not derived from the ectoderm but that is derived from the endoderm. So we will quickly walk through the key concept here. The maximum oral structures are derived from ectodermal stomodium except the floor of the mouth which is an endodermal derivative. Coming back to the question will be having the maximum oral structures are having their origin from the first option that is the ectoderm.